Hey guys, uh, today's video is my Freebie Friday haul. Um, it's Saturday actually right now. Yesterday, if you watched my um, video from yesterday, we actually went to the Dollar General clearance sale. Um, and by the time we got home and did all that, I didn't feel good and um, I went to bed like at 6 o'clock. So um, that's why I didn't do the video yesterday. So sorry about that. I'm going to get this up today. Um, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and get started. Um, last week I forgot to show you guys something that I got for free. A company reached out to me and asked me if I would um, try their product for uh, honest review. So, and the company is called Shills, S-H-I-L-L-S, I think is how you pronounce it. And um, it's this uh, black mask. It's a charcoal mask. And it came with this little tool right here, like a little spatula. It's still got me, still got product on it. Um, this thing is really cool for when you have masks and stuff because it really does get it on in an even coat, and your hands don't get dirty, and it wipes off really easy. Um, so I really, really did like this. This was like, this was nice, but you know these charcoal masks, these peel off masks, they hurt. Um, a little bit I mean they're not that painful they don't make you bleed or anything like that but they they do hurt a little bit when you take them off because it's supposed to get all the blackheads and clear your skin up so I don't know if that if it really does that but I don't know I love doing face masks so anyways there's that and then as a gift um, they gave me their um, anti dark spot whitening serum looks like this so I got those. I forgot to show you that last week. Sorry about that. Okay. Next thing I got was this. And oh, sorry about that. Um, it's a CeraVe or how are you? I'm so bad at pronouncing stuff, guys. So sorry if I mispronounce them. But this is our hydrating cleanser. So got that. I don't even know where I got this from. Then, this I was really excited about. I got this. And this was from Top Box. And they sent me, here's a little pamphlet. It's okay. Thank you. Um, that was my mom. She was bringing me something. Um, anyways, I got this. And I got a real beauty blender. I've never had a real one. I've had like the fake ones from the Dollar Tree. Um, but I have not used this yet. But I can already feel the difference. It's a lot more squishy. And um, so I think this is definitely going to work a lot better than the other ones that I've tried. And I got the beauty blender um, foundation. Which I'm so excited to use. I have heard some reviews on it and they weren't that great. Um, but everybody's skin's different, so I'm hoping that'll work well with mine because I was super excited about it. And I love their packaging on the real product. How it has this hollowed out piece, so you just take the blender, you squirt the foundation out onto here, and then just pat it on there. I think that's so awesome and such a great idea. Okay, and another company reached out to me also um, to try their product for an honest review. So... I got this yesterday in the mail, and here's the packaging, and inside that package is a net bag, and inside the net bag, <laughs> it's like one of those uh, big box to little box things. <laughs> Anyways, are 16 of these little cotton rounds. Um, these are reusable. It's like a terry cloth material, sort of. I don't know if you guys can tell. Um, it's soft. And I have used it this morning when I did my eye makeup. Um, I didn't clean my brushes. I'm bad about that. And there was blue eyeshadow on it, so I had to wipe it off. And it, it did, all I did was put water on it, and it wiped my eyeshadow off. So, but later on, I'm going to... They don't claim to like just wet it and then it gets your makeup off, but I wanted to try it. But um, anyways, and then I washed it by hand and all the makeup came out of it. 
So, but later on I want to try it with my mascara and see if it takes it off. But you could um, use like micellar water on this or your astringents or anything. And I love that it's reusable so you don't have to continue to buy those cotton pads. Um, but, and then the bag, so then you can wash them in the wash machine in this bag. And that's really good. I would still, though, before I washed them in the um, washing machine, I would hand wash them or or at least try to spot treat them or something. So then, I don't know. I would just be afraid it wouldn't get the makeup out in this bag. But I think that's a really cool feature to have this bag and to be able to wash it. And they're reusable, like I said, which is awesome. Okay, now... Here's my magazines. I went backwards. But I got an Us Weekly or US Weekly. Marie Claire. A Bazaar, which is gigantic. And then a Diabetes Self Management. And that's all I got, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.